SLS is as a student, you can actually view and comment on your teacher's feedback. So let's assume that we have uh, done an assignment. So this is, I think, uh, let me see. Uh, let me switch to a student account. So I have already completed uh, my teacher's assignment. So I already completed it. So it will not appear here. I need to go to assignment, go to complete because I've completed it already. So let's say I've done all this, uh, all this uh, whole lesson already. So it all takes now. So now as a, as a teacher, I will now simulate that I'm a teacher. I will go out and I will switch to a teacher account. So as a, as a teacher, I will then uh, look at the assignment and then I will monitor it. Right. So uh, I see that uh, this, this student has completed all the assignment. So maybe I want to give feedback to the student. So maybe it's in this particular activity tree. So I'll click on it and I will be brought to here. So maybe say this student so this is the, the teacher. I will view all responses and then I will look at the, the teacher feedback that I would like to give to this particular student that has done the quiz. So this is uh, this is submitted by the student. So let's say this, this question and then I ask for uh, upload, then the student uploaded the audio file or video file. And then there's this series of conversation that's going on between the teacher and the student. So the teacher will say certain things and then the, the student will be prompted so for example now I would like to give just, just to demonstrate this I will allow, now simulate myself as a, as a teacher and then I will add a comment to the student so I can add comments I can add equations uh, chemical symbols uh, background pictures and even a, a audio file if I want uh. so I can upload a file and then upload it so let's say I just want to give text-based solution so that concludes our conversation on this particular topic. Thank you for being such a kind and helpful student. So let's say this is what I want. So uh, the, the teacher must check on this notify student about the feedback. Okay, and then uh, now I will simulate as uh, a teacher, as a student, sorry, as a student. So now I will come out, I will now go as a student. So I'll switch to a student account. So in this student account, you will see that this is building with the one. Uh, so that means there's one unread. So this is the, the latest that the teacher has given uh, feedback. So I click on it immediately. And then I can I will be brought to the bottom of this ongoing teacher feedback and, and student conversation uh, that's been going on. So, you know, then I can say, uh, Thank you, teacher. And then post back. So for the student, when they post, the teacher will not be notified. So just take note. Lah. So this is uh, one way you can uh, you can have this conversation about the answer to this particular question. So if you let's say you made some mistake, you want to add a you want to make a decimal point, you want to make a, a, a full stop, you can also always uh, change it. Or if you think that uh, this comment is no longer necessary, you can delete it. Oh. So this will all work.